One of the things I am usually very careful about, is the selection of the motorcycles for new videos. As I've said several times, I only choose projects, I really like. Otherwise, you would notice my lack of passion, on the video's script. This is only an introduction, for what I am going to say now. Today, you are not going to see a cafe racer. Nor a scrambler. Maybe a little of both. The truth is, this is an irrelevant issue. Because it is beautiful enough, to make us forget this kind of judgments. It is something made with passion desire and definitely with inspiration it is more than enough to be here in this now welcome to racer tv I know the quality of this footage, is always a big help to brighten up any project. But it is also the only way, of showing how far the attention to detail, has reached on this build. Everything, is just remarkable. And curiously, even these static images, were shot by the builder himself. This demonstrates, we are before a perfectionist. All this had to be made by someone, who knew what he was doing. Definitely a professional custom builder, who is also a professional photographer. Right? Well? Not exactly. Everything you have seen up until now, is the work of Mark Selina, from Slovenia. Amazingly. He is not an established builder yet. He is a guitar player, with a big enthusiasm by the custom scene. His interest with custom motorcycles, started when his girlfriend got ill. And they had to struggle day by day. After that, Mark decided to start fighting his fears, and realizing his dreams. And this amazing BMW, is one of them. This is also why he baptized it, Amulet. A small object worn, to defend you from bad things. The project was born from this 1993X Police BMW R80 RT. The transformation took place on an industrial space, owned by a bandmate. A big hall full of old production machines, garage tools and a vintage lathe. But nothing would happen, without the help of a painter, a welder, and a mechanic. Pretty soon. The idea of a custom shop called Vintage Room Motorcycles, started to take shape. One of my favorite features from this project, is the rear end. Not only because it is made of wood, 
but especially because of its subtle shape. It looks very simple. But there is an extremely important detail, that makes all the difference. No, it is not the beautiful rear light. It is this curved based surface. Almost unnoticeable for most. But I see it as the kind of feature, that separates a basic shape, from a smart simplicity. Mark loved the idea of the wooden rear end, because it reminds him of his guitars. A risky choice. But he made it happen brilliantly. Just as the Moto Gadget electronic key device, which is hidden inside the rear. Another brilliant choice, is the front LED light. It is a vertical strip, just to match with the tail light. And it looks very good indeed. What an amazing film footage. In fact, it seems to have the same level of perfection, as the project itself. What is interesting, is that when Mark sent me this video material, it reminded me of a similar situation with another project. Do you remember this one? I am sure you do. But what is really weird? is the fact that they were built in the same country. Coincidence or not, it seems that Slovenia's population suffers from the same sort of principles. The pursuit for perfection. And it appears they are making a very good job. Like I mentioned in the beginning, this BMW is not really a cafe racer. But it is so beautiful. I prefer to forget seeing the handlebar and tires. Definitely one of those projects. Which is going to be memorable. For a very long time. Before I end this video, I would like to approach a different matter. You probably didn't notice, but we reached a very important mark on the history of this channel. Racer TV now has 200,000 subscribers. Although today's video is more special than usual, my intention for the future is to bring something even more special to commemorate this moment. In the meantime, I am sharing with you, the unboxing of something that I wished to reach from the beginning. The YouTube silver play button. I should have had this award more than one year ago. But I only received it a few months ago, and I thought this would be a good occasion, to show it to all of you. From the bottom of my heart, Thank you so much.
for watching Racer TV and for helping this channel reach this moment. And as always, I hope to see you next week.